Mary and devotion. Here are three ways that we can grow in our love for Mary. And of course, if we grow in our love for Mary, then we will grow in our love for Christ. Quickest, shortest, easiest way for us to arrive at the heart of Christ is through the heart of Mary. Three suggestions. First of all, when you get up in the morning, first thoughts and words should be to give yourself to Jesus through Mary. Give your eyes, your ears, your lips, your heart, your whole being to Jesus, to be at His service through the intercession of Mary. Next is this. We have to rediscover the importance of praying the Angelus. The Pope's on Sunday at 12 noon, we'll give a short discourse in the Plaza of San Pedro. And at the end, the Pope will pray the Angelus, giving public witness to the importance of this prayer. I suggest, if it's at all possible, pray the Angelus three times a day. Prayed at 9 o'clock in the morning to sanctify the morning hours. Then pray the Angelus at 12 noon to sanctify the afternoon hours. Then pray the Angelus at 6 p.m. to sanctify the evening hours. So these three key moments in the day are being sanctified by the presence of Mary who always points to our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Because the Angelus is a prayer that incorporates the two hinges of the liturgical year, the two hinges of the life of Christ, His incarnation, but also through His passion and death, we might be brought to the glory of the resurrection. So we've got the incarnation, the beginning of the life of Christ on earth, and then we have the Paschal Mystery. And who's present there? Mary conceived Jesus Christ into her heart. And there at the foot of the cross is the Blessed Virgin Mary. The Mother of God, our Mother, and the Mother of the Church. Lastly, get in the habit of praying the Holy Rosary on a daily basis. Find time. Pray it with your family. In these difficult times, we have to run to Mary. We have to have recourse to Mary, knowing that there are tough times, but God is much more powerful. So pray the rosary. The family that prays together stays together. So these are three ways that we can manifest our great love to Jesus through Mary. Start off our day by consecrating ourselves to Mary. Pray the Angelus three times a day, 9 o'clock, 12 o'clock, 6 o'clock, and pray that prayer that Mary loves so much, the rosary, because the family that prays together stays together.